Hey everybody, welcome back to Overland Florida. I'm Kevin and today I want to show you guys one of the best options for a bed rack for the Ford Maverick. As people start buying these trucks, they're going to be looking into bed racks, whether you're into overlanding or maybe you want a rack to haul kayaks around. This is one of the most customizable ones that there is on the market. This is the Extrusion Overland and as you can see right here, I bought mine and I ordered it just below the line of the roof because whatever I put on here, whether it was just boxes to store things, this rooftop tent, I wanted as streamlined as possible with the roof of the truck. And this one, for everybody asking, is 13 inches. You can get it all the way as high as 20 inches. So if you want kayaks and they're going to stick over the roof, you can have the bed rack high enough so where the kayak's not going to interfere with the uh, with the roof of the truck. So I, like I said, I wanted mine 13 inches. That way it was kind of streamlined if I didn't have this tent on there. And to answer questions with the rack by itself with nothing on top, I lost no miles to the gallon with just the rack itself. But this one's really customizable. Like I said, there's extrusions on all four sides of these bars. So your options for mounting things are pretty uh, endless. So on the inside, I have monkey fists and that's holding a shovel. As you can see right here, I have molly panels and uh, you can pretty much put anything you want on those. Um, I have a pair of Max tracks mounted right there. On the back here, I have a quick release uh, fire extinguisher and you can mount stuff all along the back. Under this, on the front side, if this tent wasn't on there, you can mount stuff on top. They have bike racks, they have um, kayak racks, anything you can think of uh, that'll fit. And to answer a lot of other questions, I have the Gator truck bed protector and that fits with the Extrusion Overland bed rack. And yes, this does do a really good job. You can see the foam right there, this foam all the way around. It keeps probably I'd say like 96% of the water out and I have all of this now this bed cover won't fold up because the I only got a 13 inch tall uh, bed rack but you can leave it on there it'll keep all the debris leaves sticks acorns it'll keep the squirrels out of there and uh, it doesn't keep all the dust out as you can see the dust sleeps in or seeps in right through here but it does a really good job keeping the water and the moisture out as I was saying earlier, the options are pretty endless. This truck is pretty small, but if you had a full-size truck, they actually make bed drawers or slides. So on top of the cover, and it mounts to all four corners of the rack, is a big slide. So you can put your refrigerator, you can put firewood, tools, all kinds of stuff, and you actually pull the drawer all the way out. Um, it has big sliders, and it's really strong. Um, unfortunately, my truck's just kind of small and it wouldn't really benefit from it because by the time I put the drawer there, I'd only have probably six inches worth of room and there's not really too many tools or too many items that I have that would only be a few inches tall. But they also have uh, bicycle racks. So on the side right here, they have a little post that comes out. You can put a mountain bike on each side of your rack. They make awning mounts. They make awning mounts that come up to here. Uh, you can have awning come out. They make all sort of things. As you can see over here, I have two mounts right here for uh, roto packs. Obviously, they're currently not on there right now, but you also have extrusion, extrusions over here. And like I said, you can mount stuff on all four sides. It's basically just an adult erector set. So if you remember playing with erector sets or Legos as a kid, this is basically all it is. There's Allen wrenches or Allen head bolts, and you just go to town. You can slide these little nuts inserts inside they can slide all up and down you can mount whatever it is top bottom left right and uh, you can also make mounts as you can see right here I made a mount for my uh, shower right there because the shower unfortunately I have a mount that goes from here to here but the shower is pretty short so I had to come up with something that was kind of like in the middle but it's nice on there it's nice and strong and uh, just get really creative. The racks are reasonably priced. And of course, there's all different kind of options. They have these like tie down things. So if I strap something down on top of my bed cover, which is actually really strong, I put firewood, all kinds of stuff there, and it hasn't torn, bent, or anything. But you can use these for like tie downs, uh, put straps in them. There's really, there's really so many different options. Once you once you look into it and look at pictures of other vehicles and all the things that people do, um, it's actually really neat. There's a huge community on Facebook and people post up pictures of everything they've done, how they customized them. And uh, 
like I said, most bed racks that you buy from companies, you order them, they're all welded together, you can't change anything. This, every camping trip I go to, I can move something around, add something, take something off, and I don't have to weld, I don't have to, you know, saw, grind, drill holes or anything, so it's just a nice bolt-on kit, and it's really strong, really sh sleek looking, and uh, not that many people know about it. I, I had no idea about this company and how big they are until I got a Ford Maverick and uh, I was looking into them and I came across them on Instagram out of, out of all places. So if anybody is looking for a bed rack, and it's for any vehicle, it doesn't matter if it's a Toyota, Nissan, Ford, Chevy, Dodge, um, they make them for all vehicles and I just want to put them on the map because I don't think many people know about Extrusion Overland. So if you guys are interested, there is a discount code and a link and all that good stuff in the description of the video. Thanks for watching.